This is not vlogging. This is vlogging. It's fucking filming your idiot boyfriend. Okay, guys. <laughs> So we're celebrating Valentine's Day today, even though today is not Valentine's Day. But whatever he's planning doesn't happen on Sunday. So we're doing it today on Saturday. I don't know what's happening, and I'm really scared. We're in line for Taco Bell to get breakfast, as it usual. It happen on Sundays. It's just booked. Because I'm a fuckboy. Anyways. <laughs> so yeah. Um, this is gonna be a fun day, and uh, hope you guys uh, enjoy the ride. What's uh, what do you say? I have to do with this. You have to do with this. You have to do flip side. Oh my god, you're awful. <laughs> okay, guys, so we got our well, I got breakfast, Ryan got regular talk about food, but this is how you veganize breakfast, talk about talk about breakfast. Okay, so this is the AM crunch up. Mm -hmm. Californian, I think, or California, whatever. Um, and on the app is what I always order on because it's just way more or less complicated to uh, order on there than telling someone on a window that I don't want anything and I want to substitute everything with all the other things. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, no bacon, no eggs, no cheese. All that's on here is the hash brown, the guacamole, the pico de gallo, and potatoes and then I also got two hash browns <laughs> because I'm living and I got oh, orange juice and Brian got two bean burritos no cheese with potatoes oh. and rice and then the Fritos burrito with probably beans instead of beef um, no cheese I don't know it's the normal one we get oh, okay and potatoes and pico or yeah. something yeah, so yeah, it's super easy. You just gotta make the effort, and sometimes the people making your food get really confused, but that's okay. And download the app. Download the fucking app. <laughs> it's made my life so much easier. We forgot to show you something, and Brian wants to show it to you. What? So we forgot the Rockstar Freeze. It's good. Oh, you fucker! <laughs> Going. You said it was closer to yours. We're going to LA. <laughs> What's happening? No. Stop it. We have to wait till three o'clock. We missed it. Mm. Okay, you gotta admit though, that's not my fault. Okay. It's fucking. There's a buttload of traffic. I want to go <laughs> on a Saturday at midday. I want to go. Yeah, but we have to wait till three o'clock, baby. <laughs> so she knows where we're going. <laughs> I want to go. <laughs> now we have two hours to kill, and I don't know where we're going. I don't even know where. So. Where are we going? <laughs> Farm sanctuary. Yeah. You're gonna need some piggies. And a, <laughs> and a turkey. <laughs> and some cows. <laughs> and there's, there's a goat who has disabilities. <laughs> I'm gonna go. We'll, we'll be there soon, baby. Brian was trying to make the one o'clock tour at the farm sanctuary in Acton and we didn't make it we got there like 15 minutes late or whatever um, so we're going for the three o'clock one so we have like 45 minutes until we have to go and pay for our thingy but we're gonna see pigs and cows and goats and chickens and turkeys turkeys <laughs> And I'm excited. <laughs> That's Boris. Boris? Yeah. Did you name him? Mm-hmm. 
know it's not. These are some babies. This is Jimmy Man right here. His name's actually Jimmy. I just call him Jimmy Man. And this is the boy and the girl. Yes, this is our only male of the herd. Oh! oh. <laughs> and he's. Oh. Yeah, they're a lot different than you'd imagine them. Uh, they're like 15. Uh, they're a lot different than you'd imagine them feeling. They're very, very bristly. They're not very soft. Oh, look at that. Whenever he licks my hands, he'll actually cut them a little bit. So I have all these little scars from Bruna. Yeah. But they're a little long. with her for whatever reason and then when she's not here he's different than that um but yeah he's a little crazy guy hey and over there is madeline um before i started talking to her i was really scared of turkeys um or i was just scared of birds in general really but these girls are the reason why i'm gonna be a photo of um they're the reason why i really really like birds now um so madeline over there and gobbles and they too are fed and bred to grow at this extremely fast pace uh, they'll far surpass the weight and the size of a natural turkey in just several months uh, and also My camera died, so I'm finishing vlogging on Brian's phone, but that was kind of amazing. Um, we 
it took like an hour, hour and a half to finish the entire tour. But when we were on our way out, we saw these little cows over here. Um, yeah, we took some pictures with them. But there was like a little baby one, and we saw the two cows that we saw from before. Um, but there was a bunch more, and the bull was out too. So, by then, everyone had already gone, so we kind of got our own little... Exclusive. Exclusive interactions with the babies. And yeah, the that was absolutely amazing and this town is like actually really beautiful it's in a really secluded area which is super nice and um, i'm not really used to that anymore living in the city but that was such a cool experience and i'm really glad that we got to do that and i have the best boyfriend ever who's invited me with that thank you that was a surprise i didn't know until 10 minutes before and we'll come back maybe for thanksgiving it's a long time I'm sure we'll be back before then. Okay, before Thanksgiving. But they they told us they have this really like special Thanksgiving event where they celebrate turkeys and they like feed the turkeys a feast and everything and they have ice cream and stuff for the guests. Yeah. If you guys are interested in checking this place out, it's called um, Animal Acres Farm Sanctuary in Acton, California. It's on Escondido Canyon and it's it's the best place ever. It's only ten dollars um, as a donation to get in, and in the gift shop, get, in the gift shop they have a bunch of like shirts and movies and um, books, and also snacks that are like all about plant-based diets and a shopping cart with a bunch of vegan. Yeah, they have a shopping cart that that gives you examples on like what you can eat on a plant-based diet. Basically, all the things that are out there, which is super awesome. But yeah, that was so cool. Uh, so I highly recommend that you guys go check it out. You get some really awesome interactions with um, pigs, cattle, chicken, and turkeys, goats, um, goats and sheep. One llama. And there's one llama. You don't really get to pet the llama, but you don't want to because they spit. But he's like the pack protector or whatever. Um, anyways, I'm rambling, but... For sure, you guys should definitely go check that place out if you have the time. Um, the most you're gonna pay is the most you're gonna pay is for gas. Like if you're bringing another person, it's only twenty dollars. So it's pretty pretty darn cheap, and it's a really great experience. So yeah. Great cost. Uh, we're going to get dinner in LA. What's the place called? It's called Organics with an X, and it's in Eagle Rock. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, Organics. On Eagle Rock, and no, maybe it's in Eagle Rock. In Eagle Rock? Yeah, the city's called Eagle Rock. Okay, it's organics in Eagle Rock, which is in Los Angeles. And I'll see if I can film the food that we get there. Um, so, yeah, thanks for joining us on this trip. I will see you guys on the flip side. Hey guys, uh, please excuse what I look like right now. Uh, we just got back to Brian's and I got ready for bed, but I realized I need to finish up the vlog for today. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, we didn't end up going to the place called Organics. Because um, it turned out the deli inside actually closed at 6. And we got there at like 6, 10. <laughs> um, but it was kind of cool because uh, it was mainly a grocery store. And they had a vegan deli inside. And the grocery store itself was like 90% vegan. It only had one little dairy section. Just a couple of products that had dairy in it. But no meat. I didn't see any meat. And then the rest of their products were vegan. Which was super cool. Um, but while we were there, we actually picked up... Um, I saw these and I kind of had to get them. Because they're new and super exciting. Uh, we got the... Vegan Egg by Follow Your Heart. And so these are brand new and I've been seeing them pop up everywhere and I'm really excited to try them. I think this is super like awesome. This one little thing makes 12 eggs. It's a little expensive. Um, right now it's like $8.99 at least at that grocery store. It's probably less expensive at other places. Um, but I'm sure over time the price will go down. So we ended up at Veggie Girl. I got... 
the mac and cheese and a mini buffalo wrap. Brian got the buffalo bomb with coleslaw. Super good. I always love veggie girls, especially buffalo stuff. I don't know why I've just been obsessing over uh, buffalo recently. But after that, we stepped at mine, got a couple of things. I need to charge the camera on my battery, obviously, because it died. And then we went to a place called the Donuttery. It's in, I think, Huntington Beach. I don't know. Look it up on Instagram or whatever. Um, they're open 24 hours a day, every day. And they have vegan donuts. And it's super cool. They're on Beach Boulevard. I know that for a fact. But what we got was... Um, we got the blueberry, which are the best. Um, everyone loves the blueberry. Um, a jelly filled and a chocolate vegan raised and a maple bar as well, which I really love. 